So we're going to try to make it to the next boss here. That's our goal. One stream, one boss. Um, we've had some good streams where we've killed two boss sets, but not this go-around. I could go to the Man-Eater if I wanted to. The only problem is at the moment I, I don't want to. Kind of scurred. Um, because... Um, Although I'm doing this blind, I do know some information about some of the bosses. Like, I know a little bit about the boss that's coming up that I'm going to be fighting against. I know a thing or two about the, um... Uh, about the Maneater boss. I just almost got taken out twice in a row just then. Uh, hey, this guy's still here. Hey, what's up, dude? You got anything, um, worth buying? At the moment, you can get some fresh spice. Uh, that that would probably get some sticky white stuff. Might be helpful helpful to me. Um, dark stone, yeah, dark moonstone. That's gonna be helpful later on. Um, with my uh, leather armor, I really probably do need to upgrade my armor. I've got six of these, so I'm gonna. I'm gonna get six more just to kind of be on the safe side, so I've got plenty of MP Hold on. goodness. Alright, I'm I'm just gonna slip past you guys. Because in all honesty, that's probably my best bet at the moment is to slip past you guys. Yeah, that's that's the best thing to do. Uh, slip past you guys. Hey, we're doing good at the moment. Oh, crud. Hi, buddy, can you get out of my way quickly? Uh, there's a, there's a fellow behind me. Thank you. Good day, sir. Alright, now we need to, uh, death and his friends. Uh, not what I wanted just then, but I guess whatever works. Uh, now I take on death. So, with that guy gone, Dark Moonstone, good stuff. Whoa, what just happened? Yeah, my, my Xbox, or my, my, um, my pad just decided to, to go, go blank on me all of a sudden. I'm like, uh, iPad, what you doing? What you doing? iPad just kind of doing its own thing, just like, ah, uh, do what I want. You know, the boss of me, and it's, it's right, I'm not. But, uh, kind of want to be, you know, I, I watch on my iPad so I have an understanding of how things are going. Whether or not we're, we're good. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have the fresh spice or the old spice at the moment. Uh, just to be on the safe side. Walk over the dead. Kind of reminds me of the, uh, Child of Cost when I see, like, the dead, uh, things there. First and foremost, get off of here. And by... Alright. That is so not what we wanted to happen, but uh, we, we do it we can. We're, 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 we're living the uh, best life that we can at the moment. Somehow... I guess he just struck me with his sword. That's all I can guess that happened just then. But I'm usually not expecting that sort of thing. The rollout movement. The rollout. Why? Why? Why for you make this harder for me? Um, character of mine. Okay. Uh, do I need the full moon grass? I feel like I, I honestly, because the full moon grass does like all health. I need something, maybe that doesn't do everything. Yeah, full moon grass. We've got some half moon grass. How about we just work with the crescent moon grass at the moment? It's going to restore just a little bit as compared to the others. But I feel like it's going to be more useful at the moment. I have upgraded my crescent, um... Falcon? Is it Falcon? Falchion? How do I pronounce this? F-A-L 
C H I O N as Ragdoll Physics. He is I say he's stuck in me. I'm kinda wondering if I'm pronouncing that correctly. It's one or the other. some fresh bice in us. You guys still chasing me? No, you're not. That's fine by me. I don't mind you not chasing me anymore. That's fine. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so we need some more fresh bice in here. Some more fresh bice an old spice, and it really doesn't help us out as far as with everything that we're doing, but uh, it'd be alright. I mean, the more we build up our character, the more magic he's going to be able to do and things of that nature. I do hope everyone's having a happy turkey day as I wax long on whether or not I know the correct pronunciation of a sword. Those golden skeletons remind me of some of the enemies off of uh, Bloodborne. Kind of the way they move and things of that nature. Just what they remind me of at the least. Okay. So, Death and his friends are going to be here again. I'm going to take in another fresh vice. And I need to remember the fact that there are some female versions of our, um, our friends. Hold on. Hold that thought. Would I die if I try to dive there? It's kind of my thought is like, well, it's there. But you hear the little whoop, whoop, whoop. Whoop, whoop, whoop. That's the female version of these things. Yeah. And uh, they don't die when the Reaper does. Crescent Moon. Crescent Moon. And we'll switch back to some fresh spice. Because we want to kill death. Yeah, I, I can think I can slip around this guy. His death is right there. Whoa! Let's say, did Death not die just then? Um, Crescent Moon Grass, quickly. I know she's around here somewhere. I can hear her moving. And that's the scary thing. Is I can hear her, but I cannot see her. Like, literally, she's invisible until she attacks. So it's like, I'm, I'm just going to head on my merry little way. I'm going to head on my merry little way. And we're going to get us some uh, fresh spice in. Go back to the crescent moon grass. Okay, we have a third death coming up. And we're wanting to be careful with him. I wonder how my uh, sword does against these guys. I mean, I can... Oh, still didn't do all that well. But it's certainly not the worst. Fact, once I round this corner... Ooh! Die. Both of you die. Somebody die. Death and his friends die. I, I, death is still, okay, death is still there. Oh! Oh! 
Oh, we got each other. That's not what I wanted. I I should have run. I should have continued running. I because mm. death, if I understand correctly, death is very much like death in um in grab by the ghoulies in the fact that he does have a death touch, as in he touches you and your character dies. Uh, and we we don't we don't want that. That's bad. That's bad. That that's very 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 bad. Again, if I drop down... We don't take much damage at all. Ha ha! Alright, so your little buddy is goodbye. That, that's a good way to go about it, just kind of run. And that Dark Moonstone is going to be good for upgrading this weapon later on. So the more Dark Moonstone we get the better we can upgrade our Crescent uh, Sword. It's like he's just started calling it the Crescent Sword sword instead of actually trying to pronounce the, the other word. Yeah. Because we here at the Moo Channel... Uh, oh, 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 oh. We, we try our best to pronounce things correctly. We don't always get it right. But we give it a good old college drop. Yeah. Oop. I... No! That was 20,000 souls down the drain. There's a part of me that's kind of like, I wonder what would happen if I just avoided death and, um... Just skipped, just ran past the first death. I'm, I'm very curious at the moment whether or not those guys were able to follow me outside. It's like, eh, you died again. Y yes. Making a habit of that, are we? Yes. Ooh, that looks like that was one of the females just then that tried to attack me. I decided the call of souls is too much, too great for me to just run past like that. I mean, 4,000 souls, guys. That's a lot of souls. That's, that's, that's good stuff right there. I mean, you don't want to avoid that. Uh, okay. Get up, get up, get up. Climb up. I feel kind of cheap doing it like this, but it's also one of those moments you're like, whatever works. Alright, whichever one I... I have... Ugh, that's gonna hurt. Oh, get, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Oh! Again, I feel slightly cheap doing that. At the same time, it's like, yeah, it works. So today's been a decent Thanksgiving for me and my, my spouse. Uh, we did not go visit family um, for a number of reasons. Um, one out of concern for everything that's going on at the moment. Uh, and, you know, we found out that my mother has, uh, some very, very major, uh, health concerns at the moment. Uh, some things that are going on with her. And we kind of talked things out and it was just decided. Decided that the best thing for us to do would be to, for the moment, to, uh, stay home. We really didn't want to stay home. I mean, I, I love my mom. I love my dad. I love my brother and his family. And I do, do want to see them, but... At the risk of uh, hurting them health-wise, I cannot justify... Uh, coming. 
I don't know what they did, but, you know, uh, but my wife and I had Thanksgiving together. Uh, don't rage this time. I'm going to try my best to balloon. How are you, by the way? I know I know. I asked you earlier, but how are you at the moment? I'm, uh, I'm not at the area where I was raging at. Um, this is not the Blighttown area. Um, I will probably undoubtedly show off the Blighttown area here shortly. But, uh, how are you today, good sir? It is good to see you. Uh, alright. Um, I'm gonna switch, switch, switch to our, uh, Crescent Sword. And I'm gonna fight this guy, and he's gonna swing down. Swing low. Come on, just don't fire your big ol' laser. Ooh, was not expecting that. Oh, I'm, I'm gonna have to step back and step back again. He just swing. All right. Good. The same feeling like I'm recovering, but we'll see you tonight. And tomorrow brings. Yeah, that's um that. What you said sounds like uh, one of our mutual friends who had it recently. I talked to him, and he said, look, I'm feeling a lot better than I was uh, a few days ago. He said at the same time, he goes, uh, it could just, you know, it, it, maybe nothing. All right, death, at, ooh, death, um, I'm going to run up here real quick, and I'm going to uh, use a full moon grass to get my health back, and then we're gonna go running. Because I know she's down here, I just don't want to go running into her. But he made that a very similar statement. He says, I'm feeling a lot better than I've been feeling. He said, but we're just gonna have to see what happens. He goes, I'm not gonna just try to convince myself that um, everything is A-OK. -okay. So I can understand the sentiment. I, I've not had the virus as of yet. And, um... Lord wills, it's going to stay that way. Then again, you, you, you don't know what the future holds. Um, I do know we had a slight bit of a scare a uh, few weeks back where we possibly uh, had been exposed. But uh, it's been over two weeks, and neither one of us have shown any signs. And so we're both grateful for that. Oh, dude, you, you're still alive. I thought I killed you. Alright, so I'm going to have to fireball this guy before death can kill me. And fireballing this guy is honestly the best thing to do. Because the moment around this corner, there's death. And I, I just want to go ahead and kill death. Because death is a dangerous, dangerous fella. And I need to kind of quickly go through this area, because again, there are some of the females that don't disappear whenever you kill the Reaper. I don't want to fall prey to them. Alright, this is the area that killed me last time, because I traveled through the area the way that you're supposed to. And then I allowed hubris to get in the way. And I'm not going to do that a second time. Uh. All right, sword. Nothing. Like, literally just sword, swinging, nothing happened. Uh, yep, we got all the way over here. 
And I said, you know what? We're going to go exploring through this area. And then I died. Guess what we're not doing now? We're not exploring through this area. Now, I am going to get the uh, fresh spice, and I'm going to replace it with the old spice, because we got one left, and at this point, might as well. All right, so we, we, we've made progress. We've gone further through here than we have before. We have a boss. I'm going to go ahead and say, I know about this boss. I know the trick to this boss. Now, whether or not I can defeat him is another story. Oh. I guess never mind then. Huh. No, there's a fog behind me. There's a boss here. Okay, before I go any further, let me look at my equipment. Yeah, Thieves Ring. Alright. How's this guy going to appear? Because there's a fog gate behind me. That tells me we got to fight. <laughs> Enable Terry Crews mode. That's right. There we are. Alright, so... How is this going to play out? There's a trick to... This guy. And you can already see the trick. He's missing lips. No, the, the trick to this boss is he's blind. And so he's going to rely on his feelings and his sense of sound. But I have the thieves ring on, which is supposed to make this ridiculously easy. <laughs> okay, so it's interesting at the least. I'm, we're fighting a, a blind guy, which is very much unfair. Very much unfair, except for the fact he liked to have slammed that weapon down into my head. I am getting so lucky right now with uh, the way he's attacking. I should be getting hit. And, and I know it's like you're a magic user. You're cheating right now. Oh. Uh, I would like to defer to... Um, there, there's nothing that says I, I can't. Use magic against this guy? Where's your sense of adventure? It, it died with this guy. Okay. Hey, how you doing this, buddy? I think this is a really cool mechanic. The fact that he is blind and is kind of feeling his way around, I do think it's easy to cheat. I mean, because you see him, he's like trying to feel his way around the room. Kind of reminds me of like the old, um, oh crud. What they had in wrestling when they had the old uh, blindfold matches. You'd see a wrestler like feeling around with his hands, trying to figure out where he needs to go, and that did not hit the guy at all. Whoa! We almost dove right into that. We're almost out of our magic again. This guy is, like, very magic resistant. All right. I'm going to try something really stupid.
Okay, I can't tell if he could hear me just then or if he was just swinging wildly. So it makes me paranoid about just kind of uh, going at him. We dove in the wrong direction. We dove in the wrong direction. <laughs> I use that magic up to out. I am so glad that he is, like, blind. We should have died. We should have died. Alright, Fireball seems to work best on this guy. How did that not blow up and kill him? Just in case he goes to jump out of the way. I, I kind of feel like this is... One more hit. One more hit. I really need to play through this and actually try to go sword and board. Like sword and shield. But I, I do not feel any um, regret over fighting him the way that I did. Um, it, is, uh, it is one of the ways you can do it. And so I took full advantage of that. Alright, um, Hero Soul. We are going to the Archstone because next is the main boss of this area. Which is another weird difference between uh, the Soulsborns games and, and, and the, you know, or, or this from the Soulsborns game in the fact that you've got a boss, and, or rather an area, a boss, an area, a boss, and then a boss. So, I, I'm wanting to... Soul power yeah, I need some soul power. I'll touch the demon inside you. I do want a little bit more vitality than I've got, and I think some... Uh, ooh, good night. I've only got once enough for one soul. Draw off from its vessel. Um, we're gonna get more magic strength, and that's all we can really do at the moment. Uh, yeah, I've got no choice but to be done. May thine strength help the world be mended. I would like to... I need to sword and board that guy sometime. I know I'm going to be playing through this again after, after our move. Uh, once we hit Alabama, that's going to be a definite. We need some fresh spice. Uh, we got plenty of health items. We just need magic nice stuff. stuff eh? <laughs> and I am going to drop off a few things uh, with our buddy here. Hey, man. How you doing? Hello again. I'm keeping... Yeah, I need to deposit some items. It's not the... F it's not like it's real pressing, but just to be on the safe side, it'd be a good idea to do. I'll go ahead and drop off the holy arrows and the bolts. Uh, anything there? Fragrant ring. That... You know, I kind of wonder if I'd put on two thieves' rings, would it have made... Or thieves' rings? Would it have made it easier to move around because I've just like danced around the guy like uh, river dance with the clogs and you know uh, everything be all right I don't know you have a heart of gold don't let them take it from you I I won't so all that being said we're heading to the final boss of area four we still need to do the second boss in area three and area five as well as the final bosses for them but we're at the final boss of Area 4, so we might kill him tonight. I don't know. We'll see. <clears throat> area 5, though. I'll show you the area, Area 5, doubloon. You'll see why I raged in a few minutes. It's literally take the worst. And I realized. It's a mixture of Blight Town. The, um... I can't think of the name of it, but Blight Town in Dark Souls 2, you know, with the bottomless pits and all that, and then the swamp in Dark Souls 3, it's like all three of those melded together into one level. 
And so our boss, our baddie, our... Our... Destructive force... Is a gigantic sea flap. That's right. That's right, we're fighting Daddy Stingray. Just kind of an odd boss fight. Um, there is a weapon, hopefully, that we'll be able to use. I hope I've got enough strength and dexterity to use it because it'll make the boss, I won't say a joke, but kind of easy ish. There's also a house I can use for protection. So we're going to, well, figure it out. Uh, if I run this way, certain doom. All right, we've got giant fly flaps flopping around. And there's an item right here. What is this item? Newman Grass. Guys, guess what we found? The Storm Ruler. So, uh, yeah. We're gonna try to use that in a minute. I'm going to wait and see if I can find an area of safety before I try, though. Because I just feel like that's the smart thing to do. While I grab just various items and completely ignore the boss. Because all, all, all that's really going on, as you can see, is they're, they're shooting things at me, and that, that's about it. What is... Okay, that's the entrance way over there. Um, one of these homes... You can enter. At least I thought you could enter. Yeah, okay. So I'm gonna stand over here in a corner and hope it's uh, a safe, a little, little safe place for me. Um, Storm Ruler, stats needed. Well then, uh, we have the stats needed to use the Storm Ruler. Come here, guys. Okay, we are taking hits right now. Yeah! I'm not hitting anything. Thought I was about to fall through the world. Okay. Apparently I killed something, I don't know how. Okay, so Storm Rulers for another so, Hey, happy American Thanksgiving! Yeah, thank you, Soy. How are you? Did um the PTC go well? Just to see it. I, I say again, this is the first time it takes me to hear in any of the Souls games. But yeah, let's just say again. Because the first time I ever saw the Storm Ruler was, I believe, in Dark Souls now. In Dark Souls 3. Did I use Ephemeral Eyes by accident? Because I've got full health all of a sudden. No, because I killed the boss. I killed the, um... I killed the other guy. That's the reason why. And... Drop him down. 
all is well. I am glad. Uh-oh. The big... Oh! Good grief. Good grief. The big fly flap is coming in. The big sea flap is flying overhead, and he's not happy. I I did a hurt to his children, and he's not happy with me. We're gonna, we're gonna stop. We're gonna hop in here real quick. Uh... Can I stay in here and attack him, is my question. Because I've done enough damage to his kids. Okay, that should be enough to kill him. Okay. And the nice thing is my... Um, Yeah, this is a good place of safety. I'm glad that all is well. I, I know those things aren't necessarily uh, fun. So, I think this is going to be our hidey hole. For he can't do a whole lot to us. Yeah, if I'm in here, he can't really do anything to me. And I'm all for that. But again, it's one of those, am I being cheap? Well, they gave me the opportunity to use this. They said it was available for me to, um, you know, they, they put it here. And I'm wondering, is this the only thing that this, this is good for, is the Storm King? Not to complain, it's just kind of curiosity on my end. I'm gonna fly over here and just kind of... Uh and the Storm King should draw. And that is that. Demon was destroyed and all of his babies are falling, have fallen to their doom. So we're done with Area 4. So I've made up for the last boss fight in spades. Because, the I mean, the last stream, I couldn't get anything accomplished. This one, we got two bosses in uh, 40 minutes. Yes, we do want to return to the Nexus. We want to buy some things. Mostly, we want to buy some soul levels. Hi there. You don't look all excited. Your feet aren't like kicking up and down like you're 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 all happy. Thou seeketh soul power, dost thou? Yes, ma'am. I seek some soul power. Now, I'm going to go with a little bit of strength. Because strength is going to be good for me. Um, and then I'm going to go with some intelligence. Intelligence. Um, do I want intelligence or vitality? Or even endurance? Mm. Ooh. What do I want? What do I want? What do I want? Don't need any faith. I'm not going to do any I'm not going to really do anything as far as a faith build is concerned. Um, um, I'm gonna go with Vitality because I'm basically a meat puppet at the moment. Um, Art thou done? yes, ma'am. I, I am done. Main I am dine. done. Now, I need to look at something really quick. I want to change, um, the type of armor I've got on because this wizard stuff isn't really giving me a lot of protection. Thank I goodness, thought that safe. I was as good as dead against the uh, old hero when he hit me. And so I want to get something maybe a little bit sturdier. I'm going to keep the, the, the... I thought I had leather armor. I don't have leather armor. Oh. Never mind then. We are indebted to you, for you fight on our behalf. I'm out of curiosity. I want to see if this does any damage to any of the regular enemies, or if it's just a Storm King type battle. That's just my curiosity, and I kind of want to read the lore of the Stormbreaker just to see what it says, like, you know, what it has to do with killing the giant sea flap, 
or I guess the C sky flap, sky C flap, the Storm King, whatever. And how'd you like that? Like the big demon in that area after fighting, you know, uh, the Adjudicator? After fighting, um, what was it? The, uh, the old hero? That was our boss fight. Oh! Ooh. Hold the phone, though. Ah. Hmm. I'm, I'm liking what I see so far out of this. Yeah, we're, we're not flinging, like, you know, storm clouds at this guy. Um... But we're doing a lot of damage. And I'm kind of wondering if the Stormbreaker is about to be my new weapon. Just out of curiosity, you know? Um, I know, I know where I'm going to definitely test it, because if I fight an enemy up here, and it's a straight-up one-hit shot, then, uh, yeah. Yeah, we're, we're gonna go with this. And then we're gonna go see what it takes to upgrade said weapon. Because if I can upgrade this, then... That, that looks like that would be fun. That looks like that'd be very, very fun. No! No! <laughs> I am so glad I didn't fall to my doom just then. That made me so happy. I, I, I was fearing the worst. Because that world transparency is still kind of a weird thing. Like, certain areas don't unlock in, these, in the levels of this game unless you have either pure positive or pure negative um, transcendency. And I really like to get the pure white transcendency on most stages if I can. Dude, it knocked him to the ground like he was a pump. It didn't do as much damage as the uh, Curd Falchion. Or Falcon, however it's pronounced. But it has a lot of knockback to it. Now, the next test. Yeah. Okay. Here's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking it's a good sword to have, whether or not I keep this over the curved uh, sword. I don't know yet. This one I like simply because of the fact that it's much longer. I do find it funny that my guy just lets it rest on his shoulder, like, blade side, right, just on his shoulder the entire time, which I, I can understand that. It's probably extremely heavy. And let's be honest, I, I ain't made for uh, carrying things like, like this. There's one other thing I want to test and see just real quick. Ah, I don't want that shillelagh shield. I'll have to put that back. I'll go deposit that in a minute. I want to see what happens when I kill one of these little blob guys. And then we'll, we'll we'll die in the Nexus, so I don't mess with the Transcendency. And then we'll explore... I'm trying to decide whether I want to explore 3-2 or... Oh, okay. I can go ahead and tell this is not as good as the Curved Sword against these guys. In fact, that right there tells me it's not as good as my curved sword. Because it broke. Already. So we're just gonna fix that back. I was so happy with the Storm Ruler, and then that happened. Oh well. Oh well. Alright, who's ready to see me? We're gonna try the man-eater first. 
Not to be confused with the anteater. Because I really don't want to try Area 5. That, no bueno. I was what? You, you, I, t Thomas, you are a light in this world. I, I hope you understand that. Give you the broken weapon, the slave shield. Give you some more holy arrows. We are indebted to you for you. F All right, fellas. I'll be with you guys in a minute. I have to um, fall to my doom. Excuse me. And the reason why I'm doing this, if you're watching this and you don't know why I'm doing it, in the Nexus, if you die, it doesn't mess with the World Transcendency. World Transcendency is this. <laughs> I'll show the World Transcendency in just a moment. Um, I still don't know how to tell whether something is pure white or not. But I'm guessing Shrine of Storms would be what's called pure white because it is absolutely uh, brilliantly colored. Um, and so there are a few things that can help with that, like killing or not killing certain things. Um, dying when you're, when you're at full health. And it's a really strange idea, in my opinion, the, the world transcendency. I'm not saying it's a bad one. It's just different. And so it kind of leads me with, with some questions. Um, it's a neat idea. I really think, um... It, it closes you out from being able to do certain things in case you make a mistake, which I'm not quite wild about. But, yeah, it, it, it's whatever. I'm gonna do like this. Alright. Whoa, whoa, here they come. Watch out, Moo. He'll probably eat you alive. It's the man-eater. Okay. And my phone just vibrated. I want to see if I get a text or something just now. Yeah, someone posted a, uh, uh, Vigimo in, um, in the, uh, in the Discord. I'll have to check that out in a little bit. Let's make our way to the next boss. Um, uh, goodbye, good sir. I, I hope you have a great day, but I'm not sticking around. Don't know if you have the times or not. But, uh, yeah. We're just running. Because I know exactly where I'm headed. I know exactly what I want to do. I'm going to try one more time to see if I can do some attacking with an arrow. Because you're supposed to be... And I just want to see if it works. They may have actually patched this out of the game. And um, I, you may not be able to do it anymore. But in, the fur, you know, in this version, I'm supposed to be able to take a bow and arrow. I'm supposed to be able to shoot through the fog wall and hit the man-eater. Not to be confused with Mildred. Whoa, you're still alive. I was not expecting you here. Alright. But if you got something for me, I'll, I'll take the fresh spice. I'll take the fresh spice. I'm actually going to try to sword and board this boss. If uh, the bow and arrows don't work. Because um, I don't think I'm going to be able to do it otherwise. Just the way this boss is set up. So, we'll, we'll just see. Yeah, 
This game needs 56% more skeletons. And creepy, spooky skeletons. And that's all I can remember the song. And I left the arrows back at home. Alright, sword and board time. Let's do this. There he went. Where'd he go? Alright, there he is. Oh, was kind of brutal. Don't get knocked off, don't get knocked off! No, not again! Ah, uh, alright. That's not gonna work well. Ah, cut off his tail! just pushed me off and there's a second man eater that's great that's that's great if you want more skeletons dark souls is your game actually dark souls 2 would be your game uh, dark souls 2 has a complete skeleton gang squad boss set they're not that hard but you do have that little gang squad set that comes up so i need to get my arrows I'm not going to get all of them. I'm going to get some of them. I'm gonna, only going to get a... Um, how many arrows do I want to get? Hello, I... Um... Real quick, I want to see something. Uh, I need 22 to be able to do that. Um... Yeah, can I hold that? Um, we're gonna try it. 250. 250. Uh, that's gonna be what we'll do. You have a heart of gold. Don't let them... I was... A I'd like to think I was doing decently well that battle. That's my first time actually trying to fight it. But once I saw, like... You know, once I got knocked off, I saw there was a second one, and I'm, I'm thinking, yeah, that as precarious as that area is, like, having to kind of watch one of them is, is enough. Watching two of them, I think would be, well, there's going to be a bigger challenge, so that's, that's going to be something. Um, that's going to be something. No, 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 I don't want to go there. I'm gonna go here. Alright. But I mean, for a sword and board... <laughs> oh, man. Uh, y you got me. You got me. Yeah, whoops is right. <laughs> it was my secret nemesis. Gravity. I mean, that that was good, though. That was good. I evidently didn't expect that. Um, I didn't expect him to turn at the last second. 
and head me off at the pass. So let me just quickly, and there we go. I gotta juke him. That's what I gotta do. I gotta juke him. If I don't juke him, I don't know why I grabbed my souls. I had none. But if I juke him, then I can get around him. Oh, our little dog is snoring at the moment. Cute little puppy. Snoring up a storm. Sawing on logs. Cute little thing. So I have, I have, I have arrows this time. I have a bow this time. And I bet I can't shoot through the fog wall this time. I mean, that's not going to stop me from trying. Hey, buddy. Hey. I'm derping it up now. I am derping it up. We went from killing two bosses to uh, this. I think one of the things that I do, I guess, regret about playing this so late, which, granted, um, I didn't own this game and actually didn't own it. Let me rephrase that. I had a PS3 and then sold it. And I have a PS3 again. Uh, but I got the PS3 like sometime while I was married with, married to Ren. I sold I sold the first one before I married her and bought this one sometime after. And I wasn't streaming when I owned Dark Souls 3. By the time I got a hold of this game, um, they'd already shut down the servers. Dead derp. Yeah, that's, that's dose. That's two times already. Uh, the thing that kind of bothers me, which I guess I don't have the I'm ephemeral eyes, so it doesn't matter anyway, but, um, you can't do PvP, and I will admit that that's kind of, uh, kind of a letdown that I can't do that. Yeah, there's my lack of souls, I'm not even going to bother picking that up in case it kills me again. Uh, let me get his attention. Hey, buddy. <laughs> really? Really? Just don't throw me off. That's all I ask. I can't see anything. I couldn't see anything because of the camera, and it's like, um... But I tell you what, you see that circle coming at you full speed? You clench up just a little bit. Makes you a little bit afraid. Like, what is about to happen to me? You're about to die. Yeah, but how quickly? Very. There's the fog wall again, so let me look through here, and I just want to see compound bow 7. We got 250 heavy arrows. Let me switch to that, do this. And he looks to be there. They don't let you do it anymore. There was a point in time where you could shoot straight through there. All right. I'm going to keep, I think I'm going to keep the bow and arrow, and I'm going to go without the, um, without magic. And we're just going to see. And if I die to the man-eater this go-around, we'll take a look at the other area. Oh, great. I take your tail off. I take your tail off. I want your tail gone. Oh, 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 oh,
I survived that? I don't know how I survived that. I need a full moon grass, quickly. Where did he go? Where did he go? Okay. Alright, you just fine. Stay there long enough, let me cut your tail off. down. Alright, good. Alright. Okay. Once again, I, I, I'd like to think I'm doing decent as well. Where did he go? Oh. There he... Side. You buffed yourself, didn't you? You're gonna kill me now, aren't you? No. Oh. Once they both got there, I completely miffed everything up. Uh, that was, that was bad. Okay. We're going to return to the Nexus, and I'm going to show off to I the Balloon. I was telling him about it earlier, um, in text, or, you know, and then, you know, I told him I'd show it to him. We'll look at the Blight Townish area. Do I have plenty of Royal Lotus? I do. I'm gonna need it. Uh, Leechmonger Archstone. And Dirt Moon. Yeah, yeah. I, again, I was doing a decent job of keeping up with the first one. It's when I started dealing with both of them at once, and I think I need a stronger... I need to strengthen my weapon some. Is what I need to do there. At least that's what my, my thought process is. Is that if I can strengthen my sword, then that will help me out greatly against these guys. And it may be the case that ditching the bow and arrow... Um, I think had I ditched the bow and arrow and kept the silver catalyst, I probably could have done better. Now, Dubloon, there's a few things I want you to notice. And I'm going to kind of not necessarily just talk to you exclusively, although... I'm going to be talking to you. Um, it's something that I pointed out in the last stream, and I think I can do this without my blood pressure going up. My dog is complaining now, like, be quiet, I'm trying to sleep. So, I want you to notice something when I drop down into this water. Hey, I'm poisoned all of a sudden. Question, did you notice a poison meter anywhere on the uh, screen? If you answer that question, no, I saw nothing of the sort, then you're in the same boat that I was in earlier when I first played through here. There's no meter that lets you know how... Yeah, the poison fun zone. That's exactly what this is. This is the... I, I, I have no other way of saying this other than this is a very poorly developed area of the game. 
And I don't think there's any other way that you can mention that. You can't roll. You could at least roll through the other areas. Um, just every bad development decision you could make, they made here. And I'm purposely not using the Royal Lotus, simply because... Um, I just use the Crescent Moon Grass. It'll bring up a little bit of the health. It'll be fine. Because in all honesty, I'm just going to poison myself again in a moment. And I'm finding that, you know, later on, it'll be helpful to go this route. I'm also going this way because um, a big, big chonky boy right there will eat me alive in this area, even with higher magic skills. Um, it's I'm finding it's easier just to walk around him. I have no idea what keeps dying there. But lo and behold, something dies through this area. Mouskovich, how are you this evening? I didn't say hello a minute ago. And Mouskovich, I don't know whether or not you are um, uh, American. Uh, regardless of that fact, happy Thanksgiving. Uh, I hope you're having a great day. Uh, we're going to switch to this and to the Soul Arrow, because that should be enough to deal with what is, you'd find in every swamp, naturally. Huh, I don't hear it yet. I don't even see it yet. There they are. Mosquitoes. So, the balloon. I know it's kind of early, but are you noticing certain um, dark, soulish demon, I mean, uh, dark soulish themes like I had mentioned. Because they are here. I hear it. I don't see it. It's around here. There it is. That's another mosquito, I think. All right. No! Well, we're walking this way through through the poison. I'm not going to make the same mistake I made last time. I guess on the plus side, I skip the gank eponymuses. Uh, something has died. I don't know what died, but something has died. Royal Lotus and the Full Moon Grass. Come on, don't poison me again. Don't pay, don't. No. Alright, there's another one way up there. Come on. Alright. I know they're around here somewhere, so I'm moving somewhat slow-ish. I don't want to just rush headlong into things and suddenly... I'm staring down two giants. That's undoubtedly what's going to happen if I'm not careful. I wonder what the Dark Souls franchise would be like if Sony didn't screw the software on the ownership of the Dark Souls IP. The final boss of Dean Souls has some leftover AI coding that was dummied out from the final boss of this game. Like being able to steal your level.
Huh. That's interesting. Slug. Can't be joking. I don't even want to mess with it. I don't even want to mess with it right now. Um, no, 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 no. Um, this is the... Huh. Now, question. Can I walk around these guys? Now, I, I could... Theoretically... Kill Chunk Boy. Come on. Could have hurt greatly. Uh, all right, you're dead at least. All right, I've, and, and I don't have to freak out like I did last time. Last time I freaked completely out because I didn't have the necessary items. Just keep blasting away. Oh, I didn't mean to walk through here. That, now, now, just to make sure I understand you correctly, what is that? That looks like an enemy. That is an enemy. It, it dies. Okay, let me reread that, Mouskevich. The final boss of Demon Souls has some leftover AI coding that was dummied out from the final boss of this game. Like being able to steal your soul levels. You mean like... Do you mean Dark Souls? That was dummied out from... I, I'm... I think I'm misunderstanding you slightly. Alright, last time we came to this area, I talked to... Oh. Oh, there she is. I'm like, uh... You might have some things I need. Please, yeah, I mean, Dark mother. Souls. Oh, no, 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 Mouskovich, you're fine, man. The poor child? Yes, the poor child, the poor child, I understand. Um, um, we got plenty of full moon grass. Um, uh, Royal Lotus. I think, uh, just, yeah, at least two more Royal Lotus would be good. Uh, Black Turpentine. I'm gonna take a Black Turpentine. You're, you're fine, dude. Um, chain helmet, chain mail. Uh, all right. Finished already? I only want my dear boy to be happy. I don't see any child anywhere around here, so I'm assuming your kid is dead. Please, buy What happens if I talk to you? This place? It's a proper mound of rubbish. All the rot of the world, living or not, ends up here. I thank the stars that I still have my boy. I don't know where your boy is. Ever since that demon witch came here, everything has turned foul. Hmm. This was a much better place before she came. <laughs> I was the apple of every man's eye. You're here to rid us of her, aren't you? Well, don't show her any mercy. Good grief. Finished you, wretched penny pincher. Just like the children of... The fact that you're backing up right now gives me, um, some pause. Okay. You're just charging at me. 
That's fine. Oh, you still... Still hit me. Dealing with two of these guys, which is fine. I can deal with. Oh, you snuck up on me, you salty sea dog, you. Okay. Uh, nope, nope. Don't, don't, don't get poisoned. Don't get poisoned. Quickly get some health. All right, all right. Just, I'm trying to get myself a better battlefield in which to take these guys. And having to back up into this is not the way I want to go about this. And we're just going to roll real quick. Please don't poison me. The game took pity on me and said, fine, I will not poison you this time. Cannot guarantee that I won't save you next time. Why the accent? Because I simply can't, I guess. I'm just happy we're making progress now. I, I feel like we're, we're doing great things. Widow's Lotus for Plague. I don't know when we're going to experience Plague, but... Uh, you, sir, are, are you okay? Are you going to be sneaking up behind me? Oh, hi there. I will say, other than this area, I have thoroughly enjoyed my, um, my time with, uh, Demon Souls. Um, this has been the absolute worst part of it thus far, and, but I think that's par for the course for a Soulsborne game, that the, if you're not careful, you're going to get poisoned and die area is always everyone's least favorite part of the game. I don't know anyone that... Uh, I don't know anyone that looks at this area and goes, you know what? I think Light Town is the greatest. Not with a straight face anyway. So, I mean, if this is the worst that I get, I'm going to count this as good. I hear you. And I see you. I don't know how to get to you. Or how you're going to get to me. I do know... there. Poisoned again. Can I move through this area quickly? Okay. Um, no, well, that's fine. Okay, so I'm going to drop down there. How quickly will I get ganked if I drop down? Not very. I'm kind of shocked. Don't tell me. I walked back to the old woman. Wow. I somehow walked my way back to the old woman. I, I got turned around. Somehow trying to attack the guy with the poison. And I, I got lost. And it doesn't help that, um, as far as the camera's concerned, that I can't s Hi there, buddy. That I can't see a whole lot. But again, this is the whole Blight Town aesthetic.
I'm also remembering that I can actually play video games better when I'm not absolutely angry. Like, you guys may not realize it, but I was very, very close to just going, and we are done with this stream. When I was getting to the point where I was um, dying, like, every few minutes because I didn't know what to do through here. It was, it was not, it was not fun. Good times were had by none. And when you get that type of at, I'm not giving you the opportunity to do that. Uh, go with that. I know I'm not die dead or dying, but safety. Where am I even headed? Like, I'm just wandering at this point. Again, Blight Town vibes. I'm wandering around without any sense of direction. Although... Although... I'm very, very curious. I don't care if it's just a fireball, because it's a fireball at this point. Is this leading me to where I think it is? Please tell me I'm going in the direction that I think I'm going, and if I am, oh, I'll be happy. Because I think I'm about to be able to bypass a bunch of this junk. That's all I want. And that looks like that's what I'm getting to do. Okay. Because there was an area. There's an area. Where I could kick down a that mm, yes, yes. Yes, a thousand times yes. No, I didn't want to do that. You know what? I'll do it anyway. We have attained a shortcut. Da 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 da. That is that that's that's got me decently happy. I don't have to go through the rest of the gar most of the garbage that I that that I'd gone through in the past. I can just take this. That that makes me happy. That makes me very happy. I mean, yeah. Things are, uh... Ew. I'd say everything's looking millhouse at the moment. I'm sorry, everything's coming up millhouse. There's Spooky Boy right there. Hey, I'm not even gonna bother trying to go over there. I just, I, I want to make it to the next boss. That's, that's my main goal now, is, uh, where is the next boss of this area? Where does he reside? What are his interests? Does he like long walks on the beach? I'm about to find out in just a moment. All right, health check, uh, old spice check, black turpentine. I don't know if we're gonna need it just yet. All right, boss, boss time guy, dirty colossus. Why does he look like the last boss that I fought? 
He looks a lot like the leech monger. terribly difficult and then he kind of whacked me one. I don't quite know what to make of this guy other than the fact that uh, he's slow. He hit me with something. I don't know what he hit me with. But it took down a good portion of my health just then. I can't fireball him. I can fireball him. Huh. And he's shooting. Okay, those are like flies he's shooting at me. So that's... Or I guess mosquitoes. And there's this big cloud of mosquitoes, kind of like pig pen, hanging around this guy. So it's, it's, it's an interesting concept from what I can see. Okay. I don't know what's happening to... Oh, my health is slowly going down. My health is slowly going down. What in the world? I'm being eaten by the mosquitoes, aren't I? That's what's happening there. The mosquitoes are like taking down my health. All right, that's that's interesting. All right, I kind of want to get this guy with my sword. All right, he's done. So, yeah. I, I guess I'd be beating him. I guess it's kind of cheap of me to maybe beat him with the um, the magic. I, I don't know. So that was that was kind of interesting. Eroded demon soul. Let's go ahead and get ourselves a level up before we return to the Nexus. So, all right, we're, we're making up for the last stream. We've killed three bosses, so that's cool. That's actually very cool. She looks so bored. She's like, oh, you're back. I'm going to touch the demon inside you. We're going to give ourselves a, um, a thing of strength. And one thing we haven't done yet is we haven't checked up with our magic buddies. Do you guys have anything good with the bosses that I've killed so far? Are you? Are yeah, you? I'd love me some witchcraft. Um, this is literally all you offer me. I owe my life to you. Yeah, I mean that, that's fine, I guess. Um, you, you, you like demon souls, don't you, Freak? Brother, let me. I am yeah. one hour here. Yeah. Um, learn spell. Do you have anything interesting? Acid cloud. Um. And that's literally it. Okay. I am fully pro Um, you guys really don't... Dude, that was kind of cool. Run and do a complete twirl. That seems almost unnecessary. So what I'm going to do then is... I'm not going to use any of these, but... Um, uh, use item. That sh okay, that doesn't give me enough. But if I do one more storied hero soul, that should give me enough to level up again, and I can use the other arrow, uh, bow and arrow. Seek soul power, soul strength. Mind, key to life's ether. 
soul of the lost withdrawn from I shall okay. await thine return, slayer of I am here. Yeah, okay, cool. So we're gonna have to go back to the man eater in just a minute. It's like uh, we're gonna have to queue Holland Oats. Thou then time. Uh, okay. Okay. Art thou done? Yes, I'm, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Uh, hello again. Oh, blah, 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 blah. Deposit item. I'm going to deposit the compound a short bow. And we're going to take the... Do, 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 do. Compound short bow, which is more powerful than the long bow because of the fact that I... That, that, blah, 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 blah. Uh, because I built up the, the short bow. You have a heart of gold. Don't so, let's go on to our boss fight. We got another boss to go. And apparently it's a witch. A witch! Yurt. Wait! Nope. Return to the Nexus. Yes, yes, yes. I don't know why I'm so anal about wanting to try to have white soul tendency at the moment. I don't think it really matters as far as the ending of the game. As far as I know, it doesn't matter towards the ending of the game. I... I... I don't think it does. I might be wrong. But, um... I, I think I would prefer to die in the Nexus rather than the real world because of the fact it doesn't mess with the soul tendency. Um, I do know I've got a boss fight after this. It seems to be like you go through a level, you fight a boss, you go through a level, you fight a boss, then you fight a boss. And so if we're still running on that, I should be facing a boss next in the Valley of Defilement. Um... But I want my souls. I don't know why it's only 200, 265. It's not like it's going to be all that great. Um, Alright. Dirty Colossus Archstone. Away we go! I take it I go down here. I mean, this looks like a, a hole to death and destruction. Okay, climb down the ladder. And being the fact that I... Whoop. I'm going to grab whatever this is. Yep, there's a boss fight right there. So there's a Widow's Lotus. And we're just going to fall. Doesn't matter. So we have a boss fight now. A lot is. Let's go through the fog and let's see the boss of the Sierra We fought so far against a giant flat flap. We fought against um, a giant dragon. And now, we're fighting against... A woman who's just sitting still. The most deadliest of fights. Dude. Oh. Hi there. Um, you? Who are you? Go forth, Galvinland. May you be unharmed. Garl Vinland. Okay. Leave us, slayer of demons. Oops, I need to do that. This is a sanctuary of and wretched. There is nothing here for you to pillage or plunder. No, there's plenty Please. for me to pillage or plunder. Leave quietly. Okay, I have a question. I, I have a serious question right now, because, like... 
Huh. Huh. Okay, I can try dropping down there. That looks like that's a bad idea. There's that guy. He's not really trying anything. I'm I'm curious. Same as that do to him. Okay, I don't know if that hurt if that's hurting him any. I mean, cause if I can get a few hits in on him before he Alright, that looks like that's doing nothing to whoever that is. How about I try this now? Ah, right by his head. Why are these not hurting him? What is up with the arrows? The Doing no damage. That's not going to work. So, do you ever unblock? You ever get to the point where you, you, you're not blocking? You're just gonna stand there with your shield? I can do that too. Aha! I shall guard with my shield and shall stand here and hope you don't attack me. We're buddies. We're friends. Ooh! Interesting. Okay. Uh, how do I do this? Kind of remind me of Bell Stat from uh, Dark Souls 2 with your big old bell Ow. big old bell hammer. But I'm questioning your AI at the moment. You're you're you you more seem like you're defending Lady Astraea than anything, but you're not really wanting to fight. And that's kind of the the feeling I get with this guy. Come on, swing way over here. I get a good, good hit in on you. He seems kind of easy right now. Unless something changes, which it could very well do so. He may start chasing me down in a minute, but is his AI bugged at the moment? He just returns to the same spot. Am, am I doing something right or wrong or... Uh, I mean, he's still ca caving my head in at times. Don't get me wrong. But it's like... I, I expected a little something more. Huh. Okay, 
to get a good hit on. Decent one at least. Is this it? Mouskovich, is this is this normal? Like, is this how he how he normally does? I'm 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 seriously curious at the moment. I never beat this boss, and it's been years. I remember killing the guy, but not being able to kill the boss below. Oh, okay. Oh, let's say he pulled, he, he put his hammer away. He gave himself full HP. Okay. I wasn't paying attention. And now he's at full health. Backstab him. Um, okay, the magic is not going to work here. That's not going to work either. Um, okay, then. This just became. a guy would be afraid to try to parry. If my parry skills are, um, uh, are, uh, subpar. Ah, you hit the top of that. difficult, I don't blame you. Actually, I can't parry with... I forgot, I actually can't parry with my shield. Because it's the Adjudicator shield. And so it get, gives me health over a period of time. But it does not give me the ability to parry. The only parrying I'm going to get with this guy is if we talk about Steve Perry or Katy Perry or Tyler Perry... Maybe Perry Mason. Rod. That dude goes to heal himself. I'm so going to blast him with magic if I can. That will hopefully stop him mid-act.
All right. Luke Perry. Luke Perry would have been a good one, too. All right. We killed this guy. So I'm happy now. So we make our way to Maiden Estrella. Honey, we need to talk. And I catch the plague simply by walking in there. Is it Widows? As Widows. Let's talk to you first. You. Yeah. You killed him, didn't you? Sure did. Very well. I can no longer resist you. Ooh. So you're attracted to me too, Do huh? Do as you like. Take your precious demon soul. No, no, I mean, I mean... <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I was able to kill the demon soul through the power of discussion. I would dare say through the power of salt we were able to uh, discuss this matter. <laughs> okay, that's that's a thing. Um Well, she's dead now. Dude, the music in here has changed. It sounds very ominous in here now. Like I heard a bunch of organs. Thou seeketh soul power, dost thou not? Why does it sound so ominous then all of a sudden? Touch the demon inside me. It's like the Phantom of the Opera's in here, just soul of the mind, just playing away. Into life's ether. Um, soul vitality. Drawn from its vessel. Yeah, I need vitality at this point. Granted, so the world might be okay. Art thou done? Yes, I'm. I'm. Main thine. Strength help the world. Dude, look at my health and my <laughs> R.I.P. Yeah, I know, dude. Dude, what is with the music in here? It had such a calming sound, and now it's just like I'm gonna do the Tower of Latria now. First thing is thirsty worsties. I'm gonna pull out. Thank good. I was. Okay. Um, we're gonna take some items real quick. Uh, sharp stone. I wanna take. I'm gonna tick, 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 tick. Um, moonstone, chunk stone, shard, chunk. And, uh... We are indebted to you. We are heading here. Because I'm... I, I I need some some health stuff. I recall there being like a, a butt-ton of demon babies that rise from the ooze when you went down there. Demon babies, they'll make your dreams come true. Do, 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 do. Sorry, that, that's the first thing that came to my mind. Uh... So for the... Oh, wow, we're hitting the, uh... Eh. We're hitting the two-hour mark, and we've made major progress. I would say. I need to talk to you, sir. Can you upgrade my weapon? Have it be a black... Uh, can you upgrade my weapon... Can. Uh, yes. Can you upgrade me further? I need more shard of dark moonstone. I can get it from the woman in the Tower of Latria. And so that's a good thing. That's a good thing. So I can buy more. Whether or not I've got enough to buy what I need is another story. I'm going to go ahead and upgrade the compound bow. At this point, uh, might as well. We're going to uh, repair um, our items. 
Because that's just a good good idea. Well done. Yeah, I don't like you two either, guy dude. And yes, they're there. I I think you are right about there being demon babies. I remember, like, I, I think I've said this before. I am doing this blind, but I have done some of the stuff where I've watched videos on this in the past, like Democracy and others, and um, I've learned a good bit. That is still off-putting, off just to hear that. All right, let's see if we've got enough to get us some shard of moonstone. We need, I think, six. And if not, I'm not going to worry about it right now. We'll just deal with what we we'll do with what we can, and do what we can. Bure the twin fangs, and then we'll go and. Um, I didn't die in the Nexus, so hopefully I won't die here in the Tower of Latria. Who knows what's going to happen at this point? I certainly don't. Excuse me, sir. Thank you. Goodbye. These guys fall pretty quick. I like that. He fell like a sack of potatoes. I love when enemies fall like sacks of... I'm liking this weapon a lot. I'm just I've said it once, I'll say it again. I'm liking this weapon a lot. I don't know whether that is relaxing or off-putting, you know, her little singing here. I don't, I don't quite know what to think of it. I've had better days. Okay, buy items. You have Shard of Moonstone. We have just enough for five. Thank you. Now I can stay here for a little while longer. In other words, just a little while before you go completely crazy. Um, what do we get with a storied soldier's soul? Uh, we get just enough where if I use another storied soldier's soul, yeah, I can buy the sixth one that I need. Oh, it... Perfect. Thank you. So we're going to upgrade our weapon one more time, and I'm going to try the Maneater again. I think, through all of this, I'm going to have the most problems with the Maneater. It's a small platform, and I've... Dabloon can probably vouch for me on this. He knows the difficulties I've had with the gank bosses in the Souls games. It took me a dog's age to make it past the first boss of Dark Souls. Um, and this is, of course, you know, didn't understand a lot of the mechanics of Dark Souls. I still don't understand a lot of the mechanics of uh, Demon Souls. But, um, yeah, it's true. <laughs> he, he, he knows. He's heard me complain about it many, many times in the past. Just death all over the place. So, the fact that I've got a gank boss at this point is making me go... Because uh, it's not like I can get help from Knight Solaire. You know? It's like... No! Oh. I did die. I am so happy I didn't die just then. I could be a black... I'm gonna upgrade my uh, crescent fowl. Uh, I need shard of dark moonstone, which is very much different than what Don't I waste my just bought. 
that's kind of disappointing. I'm going to look with my. I'm going to go check up with my guy who uh, I, I, I get deposits from, or I do deposits with, and make sure that you know have what I need. Maybe he's. Maybe I didn't grab some just then, and uh, wasn't paying attention. You know, if that's the case, then I should be able to. Hello again. I'm to get that real quick. Dark Moonstone. Dark Moonstone. Nope. All right, let's just deposit what we got then. It's gonna be slightly disconcerting. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and drop the arrows off. There's no point in me having them. Dark silver shield. Dark helmet. Dark silver gun. Hmm question you have a heart of gold don't let them take it from you I want to try something and see if I can move around in it um, okay hello I'm keep I want to deposit my wizard's clothes and I want to to try to get something that might be more sturdy for me. Eh. Eh. Uh. Lightly impedes damn. Okay, so maybe that wouldn't be the best of ideas. Oh, no, no, no. So by putting this stuff on, it's going to slightly impede my stamina regeneration. My question is, what does that mean? You know, for me. Let's just see real quick. Let's 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 just grab the um, dark silver stuff except for the head we're, we're not doing the head you have a heart of gold um yeah our ability to take damage just increased oh no i'm fat rolling <laughs> i'm fat rolling We're going to try this anyway. And I just want to see what happens. Just out of curiosity. You know, like, how, how... How is my... You know, what's my ability to take damage? I need to die in the Nexus real quick. I, I seriously need to die here in the Nexus because... Um, and that me and my world tendencies... Again, I don't... You know what? Forget it. I'm not going to do the world tendency. I'm probably going to get knocked off the ledge anyway. It doesn't matter at this point. You know, if I die to the man-eater, it doesn't really matter. I need all the health that I can get at this point, you know? It, 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 it's, it's whatever. Right, guys? It's whatever. If we can take on the man-eater... And kill the man-eater. That's all that matters. That's all that really matters at the end of the day. You know. I can't really tell. You know. Well, there, there is a slight delay on my ability to get stamina. But I can't really... It's, it's Like I said, it's very slight. Okay, yeah, it, it's a lot slower. <laughs> Juke him! You know, maybe I just need to kill him. 
Maybe I just need to kill him. <laughs> oh. That's Derp, uh, Derp 3. I'm pro juke, yeah. It's like we're gonna juke, and he just jumped right into me, and he goes, nope. I keep getting confused. I saw the uh, wire there, and I thought that's where I need to step. Alright, so we're just gonna... You know, it gives me the opportunity to see how strong my, uh, my sword is. That's pretty good. So, I mean, we might have a better shot at taking out the Maneater. I mean, all I can do is try. Do need to remember, though, that, um... The only difficulty is going to be with the, um... With the stamina. I don't have much stamina, and I can definitely tell that it's much slower. So I'm going to have to be careful with this. <sighs> Whoa, whoa, here she comes. Watch out for Dude's faster than me. Oh no, he's going to get me. He didn't take as much health as he would normally take away. survive that. You, sir, please die. I was about to make fun of myself for dying there in, in, in that way because I walked right into that, that, that magical shield attack. I'm going to try something and see if it helps. Let's try coating our weapon in some black turpentine and see if that helps with the man-eater. I mean, you know, a bleed weapon with fire tendencies. I mean, maybe that'll help me out some. I mean, it, it can't hurt to see. I think that's what black turpentine does, is I think I put it on my weapon. Okay, what is black turpentine then? Applied a right-handed weapon for stronger fire. Well, that's what I thought I was trying to do, is apply it to my right hand. I don't understand why won't it won't let me use it, unless it can't be used on the sword that I've got. That might be it. It might not work on the sword that I've got, so that, that would make sense. Uh, I'm going to throw the half-moon grass up there, that way we've got uh, that. And we'll start with Half Moon Grass. I want this back. Alright, let's try this. So what's my damage against this guy? I was doing 80 damage to him. A hundred and one. I I can take that. Hi there. Hey buddy.
Maybe that's gonna hurt just a little bit. I need health. I need health. That's fine. I can deal with that. Can I kill The question is, can I kill him before the other man-eater shows up? The answer is probably a resounding no. So I may have to get turpentine and then put black turpentine on it. But I'd like to say that, that was, for a guy that's not good with sword and board, I would like to say that, you know, that, that worked. Um, I, 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 I'm, I got very aggressive. I almost took out the man-eater, but he kept doing that charge move. And I wasn't expecting that. Hello again. I'm going to. Shred heart stone. I got a guidance. Soul remains. Turpentine to cover in fire. We're going to take one. Sticky white stuff. We're gonna take one. All right. You have a heart of gold. So we're going to put that to the test, and we're gonna try turpentine. And then, if turpentine works, we're gonna try black turpentine and see if that works before we fight this boss. And hopefully, that'll give us more strength against it. It may be because of the fact that it's a bleed weapon. Um, because it, it does inflict bleed damage against enemies that maybe it won't allow me to put it on. I don't know. I do know I can take more damage, but I'm not used to the fat roll. And the fat rolling in this is, um, it's, it's something else. It's different. It's not what I'm used to. So I don't know whether I need lighter armor or what. But it's that it long as it doesn't spam spam that charge. That's what did it to me. That stupid charge, just spamming it over and over. That's what got me. That and the fact I didn't really use a lot of strategy. I just kind of <coughs> fired away, fired away, fired away. Just slash, 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 slash. Please die already. Slash, 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 slash. That was my, my game plan against the, um, against the creature. Alright, let's try not dying to this guy. I know he's here. And there's no reason why he should come close to killing me. But, I keep giving him a, a leg up over me. And I keep saying, yes, here I am, please try to kill me. I really don't have time to, to play with him at the moment. And since this guy doesn't do poison, I think what I'm going to do is once I get to the top, I'm going to re rearrange. I don't need the lotuses anymore, I don't think. So I'm going to hold off on those. And uh, I think I'm going to put some fresh spice in its place, because if I can get the chance, I may fire off some magic, magical rounds at this guy. All right, first things first. Do some rearranging. Widow's Lotus. Put some fresh bites in its place. This. Uh, we're going to start with um, Turpentine. Uh, 
I apparently cannot put this on any type of my we on my weapon. That's the only thing I can guess is it won't go on this weapon. Sticky White Star. Will I go on this weapon? Alrighty then. So, this weapon likely does not take all that. No. I could do a special throwing dagger. Or throwing knife. Or... Where's the kunai? Do I have any kunais? No, no. I just throw... Just do throw a knife. Just to be on the, uh, just to be fun. Um. Did what fall? One moment, guys. I need to check on something. The, uh, metal pan? Flames will carry on. I know where I can get some dark stone shards. I just have to get them uh, later. did you go? Guys, we have a problem. We... <laughs> um... How... How I deal with this... time to figure out how to deal with that. I gotta deal with uh, this jerk. Okay, you can pounce me through that. I have both of them, oop, maybe not both of them, stunned. I can hear the other one running. Oh, 
Get out of the way. What just happened? Did he... Okay, he got buffed somehow. He just got buffed. This is like the coward's way of dealing with this. Um... The other guy, as far as I can tell, is still way down at the bottom. He's... he's... not even part of this fight at the moment. He's just happy to be here. Why am I fat rolling so... so rough-like? Go, where to go? There we went. Uh. Oh, no, what am I doing? Where am I? Hello. Sorry if this is cheap, but cheap works at the moment. Okay. You, sir. As far as I know, the other one is still walking, and I don't know how I'm going to deal with him. I mean, see. I feel like we need to play the Hulk theme, the the ending of the the, the Incredible Hulk. The do 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 do. Okay, no, never mind. He's he's coming back. He's coming back. He's he's coming back to attack. We killed one. We have a problem though. I'm fairly certain that what I did was extraordinarily cheap, but if it works, it's the type of cheap that I'll accept. I'm not talking a whole lot. I'm just kind of, I'm honestly trying to concentrate on using my cheap methods of fighting this guy. Um, which, you know, it even, you know, though they are cheap, I, I, I will greatly admit that. I feel like I can do a better job of fighting against him. 
on top of this than I can um, in the other area because there are crud. It's like he knew what I was about to do. Ah, oh, crud. Alright. that I was able to uh, do what I've done to this boss so far and in the cheap manner that I have done it. But I mean, if it works, right? I mean, if the AI has something exploitable, exploit it. And I feel like that's been the Demon Souls run for me so far is I've honestly been uh, messing with the AI, like the Flame Lurker. Yeah. The Flame Lurker had some weirdness to him. And so it was like... Yeah. Oh, crud! If I die at this point... I'm going to be sad. Uh, here, bossy, 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 bossy. Ooh! Okay! Ah. We've killed five bosses this stream. I am very much proud of myself at the moment. I don't care if I used magic and things of that moon short sword. I don't care if magic was involved in me killing these guys or any of the other guys, but um, I used what I had available to me, and that was um, uh, cheap stuff. Alright, before we go any... Forget it. Manifest Destiny and all that. Right, guys? Manifest Destiny. Instead of a throne of swords, it's a throne of chairs. Game of chairs. Or wait. Okay. Uh. Okay. It's at this point that, in the normal game, I would be playing PvP. But, because of the fact that I'm the servers are down, I'm playing against computer AI. And he is wrapped up in a robe. Okie dokie. I think that's the King of Latria that just died. Is the game about to... F okay, the game is not going to force me to go... Whoa! I'm sorry, Mr. Vomiter. You are not about to vomit on me. Neither one of you are, 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 are allowed to vomit. This is a no... This is a vomit free zone. None of that around here. Thank you. Okay, so there, there are actual enemies in the build-up to this fight. Huh. 
I think this is the first. This is the first time I've dealt with enemies. Before making it to a. Dude, seriously. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't, don't grab me. Don't grab me. Let me run out of the way. Neener, neener, neener. Drop, drop me some fresh buys. Yeah. Alright. Judicator Shield, do your stuff. Have me some energy by the time I get to the top. say no 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 chunk of moonlight stone all right we're gonna take in some old spice medicated halta and uh, we're gonna sit on the half moon grass and let's fight baby hello old monk oh i can't really run i can't okay oh this is going to be this is going to be an interesting fight because of all the. <laughs> so far, the fight's not that bad. I swing early, and then... Ooh, what is that? Okay. Interesting. So, this fight is... I bet this would be a whole lot more interesting if I was able to do the PvP aspect of this. Not to say that this is a bad fight, as it is, but I just think it would probably be more exciting. Oh crud. As it is, this is relatively easy. I mean, that was really easy. And I sort and boarded it. So guys, that means we've literally got one boss. Uh, well, I said we got one boss fight left. We don't quite have one boss fight left. But um yeah, that's all three areas. That that's or sorry, the last four areas. We have one boss to beat, and that's the boss of the, the final boss of the first area. As far as I know, we've got one one boss to beat. What I can remember, we've got one boss to beat. 
And uh, so we Thou made good progress. Power, That's one. Know? We beat six bosses then in one go. The touch the demon so inside of me. I shall touch the demon inside of you. So I need to be able to do more than fat roll. Um, endurance would probably be a really good idea at the moment. Art thou done? Main thine. Yeah. I'm hoping... So there are a few things I'm going to do. Um, because I'm calling this a stream. I'm going to... Well, I came back to an awkward line. What did I say before I, before I say what I was about to say? What was the awkward line? Said good night to the kids. Came back to touch the demon inside of me. Oh, I will. Oh, uh, look, look. What happened was. Are you sure? It would. Are you sure? You got any good spells for me? Hello, soul thirst. Time out. Slaying an easier, more souls when effect. That sounds neat. Relief. Fully recover another by touching them. I'm assuming that just helps me with my regular oh. stuff. Uh, if I'm uh, plagued or something of that nature. I can't so what do you have to offer me for these souls? Yellow demon. A soul arrow that tracks its opponent. Hmm. You're in the power of not his. Anything else? Rooted Demon, Wiggly Demon, Pure Blood Demon. Uh, generates a cloud of plague. Plague. Alright, I, I don't really feel I like... I am fully prepared. So here's what I'm going to do. Um, in between streams, I'm going to try to kill the Blue Dragon. Because I don't want to have to deal with the Blue Dragon. That's um, that's a big issue, the, the Blue Dragon. Um, I'm also going to try and, um, level up just a little bit more, because I've got, um, like I said, uh, we've got the boss of the next area, but that dragon, I've got two choices with the dragon. Okay, I'm still too, 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 too slow. I shall await thine return. I am... Um, I've got two options with the dragon. Um, use item. Is this enough? That's ah, not gonna be enough. Um, I can either run past it, which is a possibility, or I could try to kill it. Then yeah, that's the thing. I'm, I'm gonna try to kill it. My wife is like, try to kill it. So. You know, we're going to try to kill it. Um, Art thou done? I just don't want to fat mm. roll anymore. I want to keep this, but the fat roll, it's its throwing me off. Even though the fat roll saved me uh, versus the man eater, more than likely. So, from there, we're going to travel in the next stream to um, the f final boss of the first area, and we'll see what goes from there. Uh, we made a lot of progress today, and we're very close to being done with Demon Souls. A lot faster than I thought we'd be. And that's kind of a cool thought. Now, I do also, you know, I've been doing this a whole lot more than Alice Madness Returns, and so... Uh, that's something I want to be doing very soon as well as Madness Returns and getting that done. But, um, yeah, we, like I said, we, we made good progress today. Um, we're going to go to kill a dragon. We're, what the world is that? Mouskovich. Oh, okay. <laughs> Chonkin. Okay, I got you. Uh, but we're going to try to kill that dragon, and I'll try to record it and uh, see if I can do it. And uh, I'll have that posted on the YouTube channel. But I don't want to sit for like... I want to see one thing real quick. I just want to see one thing. First of all, I want to see if I can actually make it to the dragon. Hello again. Um, if I can make it to the dragon... I need to pause... Let me, let me... I just want to see something really quick. 
just out of curiosity. Let's say, for instance, um, we, we make it to the gold. dragon. How much damage are we going to do to it? We're going to try to find that out real quick. You two. Um, I think the I think if you scroll down, my YouTube channel should be in um, in the links section. I really need to get a YouTube. Um, I don't think I've got a. I've got to play around with the bots and get that worked out so you can see what's on the YouTube channel. But the YouTube channel is where I keep all of my um, uh, all of the backlogs of my streams. And um, if I do a recording of something, which I'm working on doing some recordings because on the 18th of December, Ren and I are moving. I do not like this fat roll. I especially not going to like it fighting against these guys. Um, so I, I've done a few recordings. I'm going to try to record a few more before we move and have them rendered and ready to go. That way, uh, when we move, there's at least some content going up on the YouTube channel. Then I'm going to do something really dumb by trying to fight the guy. No, we're not really. That, that actually worked out. Could not carry, would overburden you. They see me rolling. They hate it. They see me fat rolling dirty. Yeah, that kick. Okay, so that guy's not chasing me. Good. Oh. Can't do that. It would overburden me. Alright. So, thankfully, the red eye up here did not try to attack me. Alright. We actually made it through here without dying. I am impressed. Are you? You should be. Alright. Let's see how much damage we can do against this guy. Um, you actually hit him first. Ten. We went from doing five damage to doing ten damage. Guys, it's amazing. It's wonderful. Hitting him in the thigh, we do eleven damage. The wing, fourteen damage. This is going to take forever! The neck is only nine. Let's see if I can actually knock the guy in the head. As oops. Nine. So like we're the wing the wing looks like the, the place where we would want to do most of our attacks. Yeah, I'm about to. So like this is gonna take me forever to kill this guy. And I don't wanna take up the entire stream and be going, yeah, like fifteen damage. We're really giving it to this guy. Uh, no one wants to watch that, and I, I don't want to show that. So, we're going to call this a stream here. I'm going to kill the dragon some point in the very near future, and hopefully you guys, you know, will see that uploaded to YouTube within the next little bit. But I want to say thank you to everyone who joined me uh, here tonight. We've got Inu, we've got Soybomb, we've got Ida Bloon, we've got Meowskovich, and anyone else who may be watching at this moment, thank you very much. I do hope if you uh, like what you see, give this a follow. And uh, good night, guys, and hopefully 
We'll have beaten Dark's, uh, Demon's Souls very soon. Bye now. Happy Thanksgiving.